weren't the only VIPs at Canada House in London today. Prince Harry stopped by and spent a little time with athletes and officials gathered there. The prince had the chance to chat, shake hands, and even see a silver medal. Andrew Nichols has the story. So, who did Prince Harry talk to, Andrew? Rashmi, Prince Harry got to speak with uh, one of the rowers from the Canada, from the eights, the silver medalist who uh, won rowing yesterday, the man who won rowing yesterday, speaking with Malcolm uh, Howard, who you see there, he even got a chance to touch a silver medal and uh, had a little chat with Malcolm Howard. Have a listen. So I haven't had a chance to check it out. It's pretty, it's pretty heavy, eh? No, I don't know. Yeah. I mean, how, how do you not like your Olympic medal? No, I know, I know, but you know, some people have already. Well, no one's actually said anything negative about it yet. Yeah. Well, I mean. And then later on, uh, Reshmi, uh, the prince watched the women win uh, silver, so a nice day for uh, Prince Harry at Canada House. By the way, he was asked a question about. Where's a good place to go out in London? The prince saying, I don't go out anymore. I'm too old. I don't know about that. Yeah, we could teach him a thing or two about and that. And I don't know whether he's telling the truth. <laughs> and he's also not too old to go out. Uh, we do hear a lot about Canada House as a meeting mm -hmm. place, right, for athletes and families. Uh, what more do we know about yeah, that? Yeah, I mean, this has been the scene. I mean, we've seen this. This was earlier in the week when uh, uh, Emily Haymans and Jenny Bell won, uh, Canada, won a medal, bronze medal in synchronized swimming. That was uh, back on Monday, and it was really exciting for them there. And so it's been this gathering place for athletes and their families. But you're right. It is a focal point of Canada in London. It's the Canadian High Commission. It's been a cultural center. Now it's the Canadian Olympic uh, house, uh, but it was also a place where soldiers during the Second World War used to gather uh, in, Canadian soldiers used to gather in London. It's right there in Trafalgar Square, just a stone's throw from where Heather Hiscox has been uh, reporting and a really big part, a big focal point of central London and it really kind of stands out. You see the Canadian flags uh, there adorning it. So uh, it's a pretty special place for Canada and for Canadians in the heart of London. Thanks for this, Andrew. You're welcome. Take a look at this. You probably won't see this royal family portrait hanging in the halls of Buckingham Palace. These Team Canada super fans are having a royal bit of fun here in Trafalgar Square. Their Canadian connection runs deep. They're actually buddies of beach volleyball Olympian Josh Binstock. They're here to cheer him on, bring him some luck on the sand, and good luck.